What up guys, so thumbs here. Only got one knife for you tonight and it's truly epic. It just turned out awesome. And I'm real proud of it. It's gonna get stonewashed, but how it is right now is uh, how I like it. Because uh, stonewash is busted at the moment, so. Anyway, CT. Row 200. Alright, that's enough of the robot fucking music. Anyway, so Zero Tonic 0200 in carbon fiber with the large Anzo pattern, the, the jumbo Anzo. Um, I don't usually do this with carbon fiber because it kicks up an insane amount of dust and basically I'm sitting there inside a dust cloud while I'm doing it. That's why I don't do it often. But I figured out a new method that doesn't cause that to happen. And I uh, figured, you know, I was looking at this and I was just like, I don't want to see another goddamn carbon fiber uh, knife with a reptilian pattern. You know, it's just, you know, it looks awesome, but I'm sick of it. So, well, I'm not sick of it. You know, I'm just, on this knife, it would just look like nothing special. So, I wanted that pattern to look cooler. So, I put this uh, Jumbo Anzo on here. And truly, the knife looks amazing and satin like that. Um, I don't know, the thumb, the thumb stud is just really cool looking, oversized, and I think it just looks awesome. And yes, I know a lot of you guys don't like dubstep music. I dabble in all types of music, so just, just calm down. Yep. This thing is freaking sweet. That's all I got to show you. I have one preview for you. So my, my uh, Tough Toad Titanium Tanto Tactical titties was uh, sold. So, what I did, you know, I'm making a new one for myself. I say that a lot, and I could show you uh, basically a piece of D2 I had left over. So, this is like gonna be like the, you know, I don't know, the, the tough hog or some shit. It's gonna be like really gnarly. And this like really scary looking swoop here. Nice and thick as hell. It's not fully cut out. See some bottle opener drawings there, and uh, who knows? But this is just a raw piece of D2. Thought I'd share it with you guys. Probably look really sweet. Let's see. I haven't messed around with it inside the. Uh, Yeah, that's so thick. So you can picture it. Hmm. Huh. That might be too thick, who knows? It's gonna be sweet. Anyway guys, I don't have much for you today. I spent the whole day fixing my sandblaster and my drill press. Seems like the cold weather is having a toll on my tools, so brought the heater out here and you know I'm trying to. You basically got water in my lines and in my air compressor and uh, 
you know, I didn't get to the hardware store on time, so <laughs> I don't know. I put them in the some warm water. I put the hose in some warm water, and it seemed to thaw whatever water was in there and blow it out. So I'm just gonna have to keep the the, the hose inside my house, I guess, um, to keep it from uh, sucking ass. But uh, that's why I'm not going full. And this took like an hour to do, which only it usually takes five minutes. So. <laughs> But uh, I just think this looks real beautiful with the uh, sandblast on here. And I will be doing a collection update video, guys. And I got a few custom knives coming for myself. I sold off the Warren Thomas, I know. Good knife, really cool looking. But seriously, guys, I think we all knew from the beginning that, you know, it's nice looking, but titanium is just not going to cut it. No pun intended, but, you know, I honestly was just thinking about it. I'm like, if I had a lot more money, maybe I'd keep it, but I don't like to have a knife worth that much money and basically be scared to use it because of the finish coming off or because of, you know, it not cutting as well or being absolutely massive, too, but it's really cool, guys. I can't say it's it's a bad knife or something like that. It's perfect quality, but, um, yeah, I just... You know, I got some cool ones coming, and I'll surprise you guys with some unboxings. I know, I mean, I, at least I like seeing unboxings and stuff like that, so. The CT looks freaking sexy as hell, guys, and I'm very happy with it. Um, yep, I'm going to try the best to do, like, a video every day. I mean, sometimes it gets a little difficult, but, you know, I try my best, so. I'm going to go, sometimes I don't make a video, and I'll wait for the next day, so I'll make the video and I'll upload it, so at least when you wake up, you'll have one to watch. Um, yep, and uh, yeah, guys, so thanks for watching. Peace.